what is up guys uh sorry it's been a while since i've made a video but um kind of got busy with some other stuff going on but in this video i decided i'm going to make a video of doing the balancing shaft assembly timing um i didn't really see any videos of it on youtube so i decided to make one of my own um and in the, in the description i'll include like a write-up of how to uh obviously off the forums and stuff like that and from the manual of like the torque sequence and the alignment of the uh the uh the dowel pins and the uh the, the the keyway and stuff and uh basically on this this the sprocket here you have these timing marks and where the the mating surface between the block and the bed plate is where they would line up but there's a flat spot on the crank here that it faces towards you got the water pump here you want it to face towards the water pump in uh, cylinder one you want cylinder one to be at top dead center and there's also these uh, different color uh, links on the chain, and those actually, they go on, it goes on a certain way, and I'll show you how to do that. Alrighty guys, the chain is on, and uh, my coded chain links are in the proper locations. My keyway is still facing up. My dowel is facing up, uh, and that is it. So. Again, I will just I will leave in the description all the information that you guys might need to uh, do this. Um, it is kind of tricky. Um, I was actually I left this bolt on because you know this uh, this uh, bolt. So you know when you get the you can actually you know take some slack out of the chain by using this to you know set the gear on the chain and then putting it on the shaft and turning it and taking some of the tension. You know you could use that to your your advantage. Um, so. You could do it the way I did. There's probably other ways to do it, but that's how I did it, and it worked. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, share. Thanks for watching.